to access your student's milestone assessment results and the individual student results from last school year as well as how to see results from past school years and historical data as well. In order to do so, you do need to have an Infinite Campus Parent Portal login. If you have not created your Infinite Campus Parent Portal login, the first thing you'll want to do is create that login so you can access both your students' grades, attendance, um, and then these historical reports for milestone assessments as well. If you will navigate to the Lumpkin County Schools webpage at www.lumpkinschools.com, once you're on our system's webpage, under General Information, there's a page entitled Parent Information. And once you're on the Parent Information page, there's a section on Infinite Campus. You will need the portal activation key if you've never created a parent portal account from your child's school. And you can contact um, the registrar at your child's school to get that information. Once you have that portal activation key, if you click on Infinite Campus Instructions, we have some step-by-step -step guides that will help you getting that parent portal set up. If you already have your parent portal set up, or once you have your parent portal set up, you will just go directly to the parent portal. Um, once you are here, you'll go to Campus Parent, and then you'll use your username that you created and your password to log in. I'm going to use an account of um, one of our parents to show you how to get to this information. Once you're logged into the parent portal, this is where you'll be able to see um, your students' grades, assignments, and other important information specific to any of your children here in Lumpkin County Schools. For the purpose of this how-to video, we are showing you how to get to those milestone um, assessment results in the individual student report. You're going to navigate to more, and then you're going to go into the SLDS portal. Once you're in the SLDS portal, if you've got more than one student in Lumpkin County Schools, you'll be able to change between those students on this drop-down menu right here. Click on performance. And then you can click right here at the very top where it says Georgia Milestone Individual Student Report. You'll see that your students' historical reports will be displayed uh, last school year 2021. To access that report, you'll click this blue download button. And if you wanted to access any of these historical reports from 2020 and before, you would click those corresponding blue download buttons. Once you've downloaded and opened that report, you'll be able to see all of the information um, on your student's performance on Georgia Milestones. If you have any questions or you need that activation code from your student's school, please reach out to us and we'd be happy to walk you through this process and make sure that you have access to the Infinite Campus Parent Portal and have access to important information on your student.